Hello guys, um, so today I was wanting to do a comparison video of my work on one of my favorite tractors and favorite mods in Farming Simulator, the John Deere New Styles uh, 4000 uh, series. So, let's start with setting our spawn point for the tractor. So we're going to start with the old tractor. So here's the original one um, that is made by old iron, uh, some number, I can't remember exactly. And then a couple of people edit it. Um, uh, so some of the things to note, um, I made several videos about my work on this tractor you can see on my channel uh, weights are not functional the horsepower um, is not correct it doesn't match what the actual tractor would have in real life uh, the duels have no effect you'll, you'll actually see that later they, they don't affect weight or nothing like that. Um, the... It's got all the same options. Um, the cab. Uh, um, you'll see on mine what's, what's a little bit different. But that's not like... That's not nearly, like, I've probably put, I would say, a hundred hours or more, uh, fixing this. And the reason it took so long is because I started working on this without really knowing exactly what I was doing. And I've learned so much, it's ridiculous. Um, so, like, the same options and stuff. Um... The weights in the front do work. I believe the rock box actually works as well. Uh, there's collision so that if you drive into a plant, the plant will kind of push over to the side instead of going through the tractor. Uh, adding duels adds weight. I have did a lot of stuff to the physics and uh, XML to make it more realistic. So let's buy this one. So here are the two tractors side by side, as you can see. Um, so here's the old one. Now this is a big thing that a lot of people were complaining about, and I'm I'm gonna speak on this because this is getting ridiculous. Every single mod that I have downloaded that has been converted ends up looking like this. Do you see how many errors there are? Now, to be fair, I'm no professional modder. modder. I don't even know how to make a simple uh, steering wheel, for example. However, this is... I'm sorry, but this is sad, okay? This is unacceptable. Okay, if you're gonna release something, put some love into it. Like, if, if, if you don't know how to, do what I do. Ask for help, look on Google, um, trial and error. That's a lot of how I figure how to do things, is just trial and error. Um, another th thing is, you can see the... The gauges are just static pictures. Here's my my uh, my version. Now, if you look, you can see that that. So. better way to, to do this is we'll buy 
the duels and let's pick the year round cab by yes okay go back go back and we'll hop into this one and if I push okay so it's it's still coming up as errors however you can see where the errors are coming from they are not coming from this tractor the revised series the revision series you can see it pops up it's clean log is clean also you notice that the fancy new steering wheel as well the gauges work as well gauges temp gauge all that is is functional uh, you can see the temp kind of going up Also, uh, the wiper is not just for show, it actually does work as well. The wiper is working, which is pretty cool. So both cabs have working wipers. Uh, there's no wiper on the back because I looked at a many Google pictures and most of them did not have wipers on the back, so I was like, no, it's good, whatever. Um, you can see the wiper kind of going. Go back here. Now, if we go to uh, physics. So I'm in the 4010, I believe. I think I'm in the 4010. Yeah. And it should have 84 horsepower. It hits 83 and then it goes down, so it's it's close enough. Um, no, they're not. I, I don't know. And then if I get into this one, uh, oops, this one. And the horsepower will be 95, so it's it's off. Uh, the weight of the tractor is also not correct as well. Same with the um, fuel is was not was apparently not correct. And I've I've done so like I said I've done so much stuff to this. And then if I go. And I buy this 300 horsepower required cultivator. You're, you're probably going to be like, there is no way in fact that that thing is going to be able to go. Look it up here. Now, there's some mods that struggle pulling things due to the fact that how the tires are set up and all that. And this is just on singles right now. So if we try to pull this, you can see that it's struggling quite a bit. Um, now, I know this is for you know, a tractor that is 300 horses or more, but I've seen these tractors do tractor pulls, and I'm pretty sure that it would be able to pull something like that. Maybe not fast, but it would be able to pull it for sure. I can guarantee you that. Less horsepower, but because of what I did, all the the uh, the gears, I, I fit it with the gears, I did all that stuff. You can see that it is actually doing what it's supposed to. Let's switch to. This is in two-wheel 
drive. And again, you can see it's it's one. Now I know I'm going downhill. However, let's turn around here and you'll see that it will actually still pull it even. It's not pulling it fast. Definitely not breaking any speed records, but. You'd be amazed just how much power you can get out of horsepower, even 50 horsepower, if you actually set things up correctly. It, it's quite amazing. So the tractor weighs 5.6 tons. Now let's do that one. Park it. Um, now adding duels to the original model will not have any effect because like I said that the person who made the, or did the mod did not take that in, in effect. So, and as you can see this tractor weighs 7.6 tons so the weight actually goes up. tractor is a bit heavier, so it's got its own weight to pull, plus the, the uh, implement. Okay. Let's do something here. Uh, go to... Actually here. Miscellaneous. Let's buy the toolbox. Plop it down there. Make things a little bit simpler. Uh, where is it? There it is. Grab it here. Now, one thing that uh, is this? Yeah. Let's see if if the rock box actually works. I think. Oh, maybe not. No, not poo. That sucks. Oh well. Or maybe the toolbox just doesn't have cli Oh, it does have collision. I think. In some places. Okay, anyways, enough of that. Um, this toolbox is a bit finicky, to be honest. There we go. Customize. Let's change the power to this one. Keep everything the same. And customize. Yes. Okay. Oh, and then throw the toolbox. Now, where did that go? Damn it. Really? Okay. Where are you, you bastard? Oh, there it is. Sorry about that. So I know this video is a bit long, but there's there's a lot that I I wanted to show off and stuff. Yeah. As you can see, it still pulls it very nicely. So. This is only using 101 horses. This is not.
if this is actually going to be able to do it, but well, why not? Off, that's so if you'll see, if you look, you can see that the gauge, fuel gauge works, temp gauge works, it all works. Errors, no errors, updated textures. scale is kind of the same, however, I've did some changes to remedy the, the fact that the tractor, the original tractor could, could not pull, it had a bunch of errors, so I've done so much to this thing, and I'm, I'm very happy with, with how it turned out. This is definitely going to be my go-to tractor, and when I can, I'm going to do the 60-30 next, and most likely the, um, 50-20 as well. So, thank you for watching, guys. I'm sure I haven't said all the details that I've done, um, but due to time, uh, I think this video is long enough. You guys can check out the tractor, uh, for yourself. I did put my name in the credits because I think I have, um, earned my place considering the amount of work that I've done to this thing. So, if you want a clean, uh, 44,000 series, then check, check, check this out, and also, I will only be uploading this tractor to my mega account and not to any, um, uh, modding site except for ModHub, if they accept it. Um, that is, I was, I was unsure of doing that because, but then I was like, wait, this, this mod has been passed from person to person, and, you know, I, I think it's, um, the only thing that would not be accepted, if it would be, if it had, like, if it was an issue with the John Deere manufacturer and stuff, but other than that, it has no errors or nothing. So, um, I appreciate your guys' time. Um, this video hopefully will get enough views so I can get my, my work noticed and stuff would be great. Um, so yeah, you guys take care.